My name's Gemma, I'm an engineer and I work in infrastructure asset management. I've been in the industry for about 10 years now, looking after all sorts of assets like bridges and roads and water pipes and footpaths and pretty much anything that needs managing. I started out doing a Bachelor of Engineering in Engineering Science, which I loved, and I wasn't really sure where I wanted to take it. Um, because the skills that you learn in engineering science can be applied quite widely. My classmates ended up in all different industries. And a couple of years later I did a Masters of Engineering Studies in Transportation and that really helped to back up that knowledge that I'd learned on the job. Well, infrastructure asset management is really broad. We're looking at looking after our assets from the design right through to disposal, which is huge. One of the main things that we look at is forward work programming and planning, so predicting what the need is going to be in the future. It's kind of hard to pinpoint what one person might do, and that's one of the things that I've loved about my work is it is very varied. In the teams that I've worked in, we've had asset management engineers, asset managers, analysts, data analysts, valuation experts. There are other options in terms of different technical specialities within the industry, so things such as programmers, people with IT backgrounds, also data analytics is a huge part of what we're doing these days, and also geospatial, so people with qualifications in GIS and geography, making maps and things like that. We need to maintain our assets and we only have a limited amount of resources to do that. Of course with climate change being quite a constraint, that's one of the things that we need to bring into with that resource optimization. Make sure that what we're doing is sustainable for the future generations. I sort of ended up in the job by accident. I didn't really know what asset management was and coming from um, engineering science background, I really didn't know a lot about the subject at all. So I got into a road asset management team, didn't know anything about roads and I wasn't really sure how it was all going to go but um, bringing my skill set from engineering science, so my data analytics and optimization, they certainly had ideas of where I was going to fit into the team. There's no one size fits all approach for infrastructure asset management so I would recommend that students coming in make the program your own. There are so many options of different papers from the engineering faculty and other faculties, so really make the most of the options that are available. Choose what you enjoy and tailor the program to suit your interests and what you like.